So this is a video on how to download Black Dragon presets and um, upload them into the Black Dragon viewer so that you can use other people's presets. Um, I know a lot of people have been asking about this, so I'm going to try to explain it to the best of my ability and hopefully it helps. Um, please keep in mind that I am on Windows 11, not Windows 10. So if you have Windows 10, my setup for my file explorer may be a little bit different as far as the menu goes, but it's pretty much the same, y'all. Like it's it's everything is there. You just really have to <laughs> look. But <clears throat> we're gonna start. So we're gonna start by downloading Swain's um presets from his photography group on Facebook. So we're gonna go there. And let's see, let's find them. They are, where are they? Okay, so here they are right here. Um, this is the post right here where he says, um, these are his 2022 Black Dragon graphics settings for the new viewer that's been updated to 4.04. .04. Um, use these settings as is or base to create your own. And so, yeah, we're just going to go through here. He basically puts, you know, all the um, settings and basically what they are here for you. Um, so we're going to first go to the download link, which is right here. It's a Google Drive link. As you see, he have all of them into one folder. But keep in mind, if you download it by just one folder, like if you just download the folder by itself at once, like if you click right here and go to download, um, you are going to have to rename each when like, okay, before you put it into the viewer. So instead of doing that, I like to just right click on it and go to download one by one, okay, because don't nobody have time to be renaming stuff. So I downloaded them one by one. And whenever you download it, of course, it's going to go to your download folder, which is right here. There should be 10 presets. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're going to write, we're going to click on one. Then we're going to go down and we're going to select all of these. Um, I do this because, I mean, you can copy it, but I just do this because I know how to get it again. So it's like, whatever. Um, so I'm going to hit cut and this is how you're going to place it into Black Dragon Viewer. So you're going to click on this PC, right? And then you're going to go to the windows of your C drive at the top. Okay. So you see the folders that are grayed out. These are the hidden folders that I can now see. If you don't unhide these folders, you're not going to be able to get to where I'm going y'all. So you need to go up to the top where it says view. And where it says show more, you need to have hidden items checked so that you may see the hidden folder items. Okay. Um, if you're on Windows 10, it may be a slight difference in this menu change. Um, I'm not sure, but it should say something like show hidden folders, show hidden items, show all folders, something to that nature, y'all. Something like that. So that's what I did first so that I can see all of these folders. Um, but you want to go to users. Um, whenever you go to users, you're going to go to whatever your um, profile name is. Mine is KYT18. So I'm going to cl double click that. And then from there, I'm going to click on app data. If you don't have the folders viewable that are hidden, you, you won't see this folder. So that's why you have to unhide all your folders in order to see it. So then I'm going to go to app data. You're going to go to roaming. You're going to go to the black dragon folder right here. Then you're going to go to user settings and then you're going to go to presets and you're going to go to graphics and then you're going to right click and paste. It's that simple, it's like that simple. Um, again, if you don't see the app data folder, you want to make sure you unhide all your folders by the way that I told you. Um, after that is done, you're good to go. You can now open up Black Dragon. And whenever you do, you will see um, 
the preset in your viewer okay so if you um whenever you put those presets into the preset folder up here on the viewer at the top you should see all his presets right here see how they're all listed and these two presets are my own presets that i made by myself so if you do not see his there that is because you first have to create a preset in order to um add more basically so whatever you're doing um if you don't have any presets up there yet all you do is open up preferences um, go to display and click right here name your preset whatever you want to name it and then click save whenever you do that it'll pop up in this little this preset pane this little window right here and then you should do the steps that I told you on how to, um, you know, download and move them to the Black Dragon Viewer. But um, that is all. So, yeah, I hope this helps um, somebody.